Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. This video is about how to make a taxi booking website using WordPress. In this video, we will demonstrate to you how to create a WordPress account, how to get a domain for your taxi booking website and we will also reveal a plugin that you can easily use to start your own taxi booking website in a few steps. So watch this video till the end to better understand all these steps. To make a taxi booking website using WordPress, you need an account on it. If you already have a WordPress account, use this login button on the top right corner to log in or else click on this get started button to create an account. You can create your WordPress account and start your website in just three steps. This is the first step which is signing up. On the sign up page from here, you can use your Google ID or Apple ID to sign up or else you can also use your email address. Here enter your email address, then here create a username and then create a password here. By creating an account on WordPress, you agree to their terms of service and have read their privacy policy. And once you're done with filling all the details, click on the create your account button. Now in the second step, you will have to choose a domain name. In the search bar, enter your desired domain name. As our website is related to taxi booking, we are typing in book your ride. In the search results, you will see some suggested domain names related to your preferred domain name with extensions like .in, .com, .blog, etc. You can continue with any of these domains, but then all of them are paid and you will also have to renew them every year. If you don't want to decide the domain name right now, you can do it later by using this choose my domain later link. Also, you can connect your domain purchased elsewhere to your WordPress site through mapping or transfer by using this use a domain I own link. And if you don't want to continue with any paid domain name or you don't own any domain, you can continue with this free domain name with an extension of wordpress.com. For this, click here on the select button. Now in the third and last step, you need to select your plan. WordPress has four membership plans, which are personal plan, premium plan, business plan and e-commerce plan. You can continue with any of these paid plans but if you don't want to use any paid membership plan, you can continue with the free site by clicking here on the start with the free site link. Now you will be asked some questions about your profile and website. You can continue with them or else click here on the skip to dashboard link and you will be taken to your dashboard. Now let's give a name to our taxi booking website. Click on the name your site button. On the next page here, enter a name for your website. We are entering book your ride and then click on the save settings button. In the top of the left sidebar, you will see your website's name and its related domain. Now in order to start our taxi booking website, we need to install a plugin to our site. In the left sidebar, you will see many tabs. Click on the plugins tab. On the plugins page in this search bar, search for taxi booking. In the search results, you will find 18 plugins that you can use for your taxi booking website. You need to go through the entire search results to find a suitable one. Here we are continuing with this one named WP Ride Booking because it has 400 active installs. So click on it. On this page, you will find a complete description about this plugin. Here you will see that it has a 4.3 star rating which is very good and here you will see the last updated version and active installations details. And once you're satisfied with this plugin, click on the install button. After installing the plugin, you will see that a taxi booking tab has been added in the left side bar. In the taxi booking tab, there are four options which are orders, vehicle, payment methods and settings. In orders, you can view all the orders placed for taxi booking and you can also add orders to book a taxi from your side. In vehicles, 
you can add all the vehicles that have been added to complete ride for taxi booking and you can also add new vehicles in the list that can be used for completing rides. In payment methods, you can view and add payment methods that can be used to get paid after completing rides. And in settings, you can make changes in the plugins preferences for your taxi booking. Let's click on the orders option. On the orders page, you will see all the orders that have been placed by users. In the orders list, you will find three types of orders which are completed, rejected and accepted. The orders which have been successfully completed and have been paid will be marked as completed. The orders which have been rejected due to certain reasons, for example unavailability of cars, will be marked as rejected. And the orders which are open and are under progress will be marked as accepted. You can also place an order from your side. To do so, click on the Add New button. Now on this page, you need to fill in some details. Here, enter your full name. Then enter your email address. Here, select the country code from this drop-down and enter your phone number. Now here, enter the pickup date and select the time from the drop-down menu. Here, enter the complete pickup address. Here, enter the drop-off address. If you need a child seat, then select it from this drop-down menu. Now here, enter your preferred car for your ride or else select the Get Available Cars option. Now here, enter the price for your ride. Then here, enter the payment name. And if you want to add any notes for the payment, you can write them here. And once you have filled in all the required fields, click on the Save button and your order will be saved. Now come to the Vehicles tab. On this page, you will find all the cars that have been added to your taxi booking website for completing rides. To add a new car, click here on the Add New button. Now on this page, you need to fill details about your car, like a title, minimum passengers, maximum passengers, maximum suitcase, maximum child seats, child seat price, additional car type, flat fee, minimum trip distance, flat fee if trip less than minimum distance, price per mile, charge per min, and description. In the last, you have to select the availability of your car. And once you have filled all the required fields, click on the Save button and your car's details will be saved in the list. Now click on the Payment Methods tab. On this page, you will see all the payment methods that have been added to your taxi booking website. To add a new payment method, click here on the Add New button. Now here enter the title for your payment method and from this drop-down select the payment method. You can choose between cash and PayPal. And if you want to add a description for this payment method, you can note it down here. And finally click on the Save button and your payment method will be added to the list. With this, we have completed our tutorial on how to make a taxi booking website using WordPress. This brings this video to an end. We truly hope you benefited from it. If you have any suggestions or want us to make a video on any specific topic, feel free to comment below. We will see you soon in our next video. Till then, stay tuned and stay subscribed to our channel.